Hi guys, so last weekend, Kath B showed us how to make the bubble mixture. And you can click here to make the bubble mixture. Yeah, here, Kath, fingers up here. That's right, not down here, because that's the bubble mixture, but the link's here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, sorry, Susie. <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> So this week, what are you going to show us? Well, this week I'm going to make the bubble wand so that you have something to blow your bubbles with. Ah, fantastic. Yeah. The bubble wand, Kath, have you got a song for that? No. What? You've I got don't. a song for everything. I do, sorry. I haven't <laughs> written a bubble song. Well, I go. mean a bubble wand song. Bubble wand song. Okay, well, Let's there you go. Mix. There's a challenge. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> but you can just about write a song for anything, can't you? Mm. Mm. What's yeah. the craziest thing you've written about before? Um, I've written about a lot of crazy topics, mm. but the sort of, the, the strangest, oddest song I've written is called We Go to the Beach. And it's strange because, I know it doesn't sound strange, no, but it's strange because there's no instruments, it's just a purely voice echoing. Oh really? And then it's got sort of sound effects in the background. Do so. it, do it. Okay, so I go, we go to the beach. We go to the beach. We take a towel each. We take a towel each. We might eat a peach. We might eat a peach. We go to the beach. We go to the beach. That's right. But and it goes on and on. Okay. Yes. Mm. So each time there's sound effects that go with each line. So right. it's pretty crazy. What CD is it on? It is on the All Sorts CD. Aha, uh -huh, which I happen ah, to have here. That's right. It is too. Here we go. The All Sorts CD. It's a Kath B CD and it's got all sorts on it, hasn't it? <laughs> it <is. laughs> Including, we go to the beach. We go to the beach. Go That's check right. it out. Actually, I'll put a link to Kath B's website down here. You can find all her CDs there. And you can also get the CDs as a USB. You can. So all the, all the songs from all the CDs yep. are on a USB, um, which you can uh, get from uh, my website, for Great. sure. But don't buzz off and do that yet. <laughs> We're going to see how these magic wands are created. Okay. Right. So I bought some wire, just from a discount store. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's just called cable tie wire, I think. Or okay. tie wire. Tie wire, yeah. okay. And then you unroll some. About a specific amount or? It's sort of an about. Yeah. But uh, however long you want your wand. Be. Yes, however long you want your wand, exactly. Mm -hmm. So around that, and I did find that you can cut it with wire cutters or right. even with scissors you can cut okay. it with. Mm. Maybe not your good scissors, use an old pair of scissors because yes. something like that would really blunt them. Yep. Yes, it would. So you decide how big you li you'd like your Hope bubbly to be, bit yep. to be. Mm -hmm. Hope. Mm. And you, um, I think we're going to make a smaller one this time. And you just sort of fashion it into the way you want it. And you do a little twist. Great. A good idea would be to test the mouth of the, well don't actually put it in completely because there's bubble mixture in there, but give you an idea yes. if it's going to fit. Make sure it's going to fit the container. Good that's, idea. That's a good Susan. size, that one. Very good idea. Great. Okay, and then you twist. It's quite a difficult bit, this bit. So you twist a couple of times. You can sort of do it like that. Mm -hmm. And then it starts it off. The helping hands of an adult might be good. Yes, yeah. I think so. It is quite a fiddly bit, actually. And then you get some beads. And you can buy whichever beads you like. But mm -hmm. I've got some wooden beads here. And maybe um, we'll spell, see if we can spell something. Well, you've got Kath on that one. I have, I've got Kath on Would it be cheeky of me to ask for Susie? Yes, I reckon yeah. that would be that. I don't think that would be cheeky oh, at good, all. Good, good, good. So I found an S. See okay. if you can find a different, Great. your different U. Um, yes, U. Okay. Now I'm going to put this, thread it through See. both pieces of wire there. So and then we've got a U. A really good idea would be to have... The letter's um, ready to go. Yeah, the letter's ready to go would be really good. <laughs> But also with um, the beads having big holes in them. Ah, yes, that's so right. So you can thread the wire through. Yes, we've got S, we've got an upside down U. U, okay. Whoopsie. We'll put it up the right <laughs> It could be an N if it's an upside down U. It could be. S, U, Z. And oh, we can't got a Z. Find a, can't find a Y. So well, we'll spell it with an I instead. Okay. Okay. Or you could just be Suze. Well, I often am Suze, so we could leave it as Suze if you wanted. Oh, yep, you Suze. Can. Okay. Radio Suze. Now we're going to grab some colours you can choose and we're going to just put them on one side. Have some purple, okay. some green, 
excellent this is a bit fiddly too but it's good I'm sure you'll all be able to do this and we'll have some pink on the side well we're rushing this you could take your time you definitely could we are going fast you could even try making your own beads have you ever oh, tried doing no, that? No, I haven't. How do you do that? Oh, we'll save that for another oh, Susie and cool. Friends Club. Oh, cool. I can't wait. That? That'd be awesome. Okay, that's probably enough. Yep, that's good. And then we can put any other letter you'd like to put on there. We might put a C for Kato. Okay. Or, and I sort Great. of twisted that as well at the end of there so that it tied those, sort of stopped those from moving. Mm -hmm. So we put a C on. Susie, <laughs> and then we can put some more of the little beads on. Yep. Do you have to have beads on your bubble wand? No, you don't. You could just use a piece of wire. In fact, when I wanted to test my bubble mixture mm -hmm. out and I didn't have my wand yet, I just grabbed a twisty tie. And oh, I just wow. twisted it around. I just found one in the drawer and I just twisted it around and... Uh, that's a nice long one though, it helps if it's a nice long one. It does, yes. Yep. This is a bigger one than like a bread one or whatever they sure. use them for now. So yeah, you can and you just, just twist it. it. Sure. Fancy that. Okay, brilliant. Okay. How so do you then finish you, it off? You twist this off a bit mm -hmm. and then you get your long nose pliers and you curl your last ends around as much as you like really. And that sort of makes a nice little decoration at sure. the at the bottom. And it hides those sharp pointy ends. It does. Great. Yes, that's right. Great. So a pair of pliers, some wire, some beads, some bubble mixture. And voila. A bit of patience. And that's yours. Lovely. Sue's C's. Sue's C's. C's. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. And yes, bubble mixture definitely does make you smile. So does making it and so does Kathy. Brilliant. Thank you for joining us, Kath. Thank you, Susie. We remember the links to Kathy's other bits and bobs. We'll put them all here again and come back and join us again another day. Bye. See you next week. Bye. Remember, if you enjoy this Susie and Friends video clip, you can like us, you can subscribe to us, and you're more than welcome to share us with everyone you know. <laughs> we'll have another clip for you next week. Until then, have a fabulous week, and if you want more information, head to www.susie.co.nz. See ya.